You took your mom to the Golden Globes. I took Globes. my mom to the Golden Globes. That's yes. That's sweet. It had been a while. Oh, it had been. <laughs> it had been a while since she'd been to one of those things. I mean, yeah, but it, it kind of makes it more interesting. And yeah, I just kind of lean into her a little bit. And those things are weird anyway at the best of times. Um, we were sitting with Warren Beatty, and she enjoyed that. And I was kind of annoyed that he didn't name the winner in my category because I might have been in with a shot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's terrible. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, <clears throat> Terrible. Warren, if you're, does Warren watch your show? I'm yes. sure he does. Warren, yes. I'm sorry. Um, terrible low blow. But no, we had a good time. It was easy. It was laid back. Yeah. And, and uh, I hear that the food is served early, early. I've never seen anyone food? eat. No, I've never seen anyone eat either. In Hollywood. In, at that, <laughs> <laughs> anything that's not salad or lentils, um, at that ceremony. I think they put in, I think they pipe in some pre-recorded scraping of forks and, and knives. <laughs> On the plates, because I think they serve it at like 12 o'clock in the day, so by the time you get there, there's chocolates going around, and I ate the chocolates, I just right. spent two hours. No, it's mainly chocolates. just alcohol, but I think they yeah, don't yeah, yeah. want people to eat because they want uh, everyone to drink, so they say whatever they want to say. Yeah, 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 which works out. Yeah, it does. Yeah, especially when Ricky is not, is not hosting. Yeah, race. Ricky says whatever he wants. Oh, my God. Yeah. I heard, yeah, what was it? Yeah, it was one year when he was hosting the Golden Globes, and I was told beforehand that he'd given a list of people that he wanted to introduce, because he didn't get to introduce everyone. Mm -hmm. And I was on the list, and I was like, oh, Jesus. Yeah. But it was very, he was actually very kind. Yeah. It could have been much worse. He's a funny guy. He's very edgy, but I like him a whole lot. I no, he's great. All he yeah. said, I think, what did he say? He said, uh, I hate cliches, something along the lines of paraphrase, I hate cliches in Hollywood is full of them. Um, things like, you know, all Irish people are, are uh, you know, overblown, drunken alcoholics. Ladies and gentlemen, Colin Farrell. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Could have been worse. Yes, that yeah. was not bad. Especially because I was sober three yeah. years. And, if and I had right. ambled on the stage, yeah. like. No, but. you proved that wrong because you're you're sober. You've been sober how long now? Ten years. Look. Congratulations. Thanks. That's Thank great. You. Thanks. That's all right. You look Thanks. fantastic. Thank you. I mean, you really do. You look fantastic. You have a birthday coming up, and you're going to be how old? Forty-one. Forty-one. Yeah. And do you care about like? No, I love getting older. Yeah. Who cares, right? Yeah. Except. Getting hair in strange places and <laughs> losing hair in not so strange places a bit. So yeah. it's kind of an inversion that's unfavorable. But, <laughs> but. I robbed that from Billy Crystal and City Slickers, by the way, for anyone that cares. <laughs> anyone remember that line? No. OK, good. I shouldn't have said it. You are in uh, sexy, bushy beards. You nice. Ma you made sexy, bushy beards. Nice. I mean, you're clean shaven now, or not clean shaven. sexy back one follicle at a time. Uh-huh. <laughs> Look at all those handsome boys. Yeah, I know. So congratulations to that. Thank you. Although you shaved it, good. so... Um, I did, you... but it grows back. Yeah. By dinner tonight. By dinner tonight. <laughs> <laughs>